Remember, it is by the stripes of Jesus Christ that we are all healed. This brother has syphilis. This lady has peptic ulcers disease. Deliverance and healing is going on. The power of God is touching them for their freedom. Sister has evil attacks. With this touch of God's power, they are being set free. You survived a very terrible accident. It's true for Nabib. It's true, Prophet. My name is Nabib. Kenya. Man of God, what you have said is true. I got a motorcycle accident in Kasubi and I almost died in that accident. Since then I have no peace, I have body tremors and headache. Because you dreamed that you are falling into a lake or sea. But after that, you got the accident. What you have said is true, man of God. But because you didn't drown, that is how you survive. What you have said is true, man of God. Until you are I am married. Don't let that fat man trouble you. What you have said is true, man of God. Tell him I'm married. I have a man. Don't trouble me. Don't trouble me. And walk away. Because you know what happened. And you know your growing up was not easy. You grew up in hardship. What the man of God has said is true. Our family was not so good. Our father had some money, but he would not care for us the way he would, and we suffered so much. He would always put us aside. So this is the issue now. By the blood of Jesus. Come on! <laughs> Deliverance is going on for Sister Erina. She has come with a headache, a case at work, and marital problems. Brothers up. Yimuka. How are you feeling now? I'm healed, even the headache is healed. Clap for Jesus. You say spirit of poverty. I remember you had a big land. Oh, you know, you have you know, 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 you Man of God, what you have said is true. That land is there and it is in Busoga. But then my neighbors came and they wanted to take that land. We went into court and I won the court case over that land. But still, even when I put the farm on that land and everything that I was working on that land, they destroyed it. And this is the situation in which I am man of God. Okay, now I'm praying for you. That the people who were engineering the whole issue that they run away from the land. Let them leave you alone. So don't worry. Now everything will be okay by the blood of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Here is Sister Nakanjako with an itchy skin disease. My name is Jesus. It has eaten up the entire skin all over the body for two years. By the blood of Jesus. Be here. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Woman, rise up. This is the end of your sickness. Since now, 
it is over. But remember your God certain jiri. It was in a small glass park. Mm. I remember that mm -hmm. I got white jelly in a glass bottle and I smeared it on my body. What you've said is true. Since that time, you got this disease. This is not witchcraft. It is what you put on your body. I think you are a beautiful woman. Yet, but you apply the jelly that doesn't Don't match do with that you. Again. And uh, the tablets they were the tablets they were giving you. Stop it because it is now resulting into this fat body. What you have said is true. I went to a doctor and he gave me a lot of tablets to treat the skin. Once I took those tablets, my body became fat like this. What you have said is true, man of God. Go, you are free. From the time, from the time you dreamt red ants entering your house. My name is Nashiranda Mariam. And I come from Seta. What the man of God has said is true. I dreamt red ants. I dreamt when red ants. I dreamt when red ants had entered the house and they had filled up the sitting room. So I said, eh, I have never seen this. Since that time, your life has not been okay. You feel a lot of heat. It's over. My name is Nachiranda Mariam. From Seta. And the prophecies say that ever since I got a dream of the red ants, my life never remained the same. What the prophet has said is true. I dreamt that in my sitting room and on the door of my house there were filled red ants. I stood and shouted, I said, eh? Ever since that dream, whatever I was doing failed. I feel burning sensations in the chest. I had four shops, but they all got squandered. I started a cleaning come, come, company. Come I started a cleaning company, but it also collapsed. You are going back to your shops. There's a woman who had a child with convulsions. Conversion. And you help the woman. What the man of God has said is true. The woman has a child with convulsions is my mother yes. and that child is my sister. Is my sister. That what the man of God has said is true. The woman that he's talking about who has a child that has convulsions, that woman is my mother and that child is my sister. That child also has a deformed foot. I brought that child to Kampala to treat the child. Ever since that time, I have a company that takes people abroad to work, but the agent is just taking our money. I even failed to pay the, the debt that I have over that man of God. Watch your way. Because you dream that you are about to fall as you are going out of the working place. What man of God has said is true. When I was coming from the office, I got a dream that I was falling in the pit. Some other people are good. But they come and they spy on your goodness. 
and they start doing funny things on you. That is why your right leg was feeling pain. Right from up up to the top. What man of God has said this to you? What the man of God has said is true. One day I was entering the office and I put my right leg forward. Then I felt pain in this leg and I said, oh no, I never feel pain in that leg. But ever since that time I started feeling pain and it started coming from up going downwards. You are free. Go back to your office and work. But watch your way. Thank you very much. Brother Muzamir who has hypertension for two years. The headache, the heart palpitations and the blood vision are all being put to an end. Where are the brown girl? After the brown girl, you got this hypertension. Where is she? I'm from Wampeo. She's brown and medium. Man of God, what you've said is true. That brown girl is in Jordan. She's brown and medium size. You, you didn't agree on her going. She was my girlfriend. We fell in love when I was there in Afghanistan. We met via Facebook. 2017, when I came back, we met physically. We had a discussion. Then I went back in the month of August. When I was about to come back in the month of March, she called me and said she wanted to go abroad. I asked her, why are you going abroad and what are you going to do there? Moreover, you can earn enough money in Kampala. She said, no, I want to go. We didn't agree upon her going. And I told her, if you want to go, all right, you wait for me. I first come back, then you go. That really troubled my mind and my head. You got a love sickness. What the man of God has said is true. I've been suffering from love. The pressure is how much? Pressure your love with you. The love pressure. Of Brother Chisto Muzamiru is at 150 over 100. This love is so high. Man of God, I'm so surprised. I never knew that this is what was troubling me all along. When I went to Dubai, just say that the love issue put me out. When I went for medical test, the love issue put me out because it was so high. Oh, rise up. Yimuka. Oh, this boy. Let us reduce the love level so that you can go back to work. Now the love has gone down. Father, he's your son. Reduce all this pressure love. Allow him to go and work. Amen. 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 There is a house. And you always dream the same house. When you are trying to open its door. Please throw my light, man of God. I said there is a house with the issues. And you dream that you are trying to open 
the door of that house. It's true. It's true. I'm telling a From Busega. What man of God has said is true. There's a house I had bought. And it is where I got that sickness from. Ever since I entered that house, I got several problems and, and getting bad the time dreams. you dreamt a chain. What the man of God has said is true. Nalota. You are trying to lose yourself. Man, man of God, what you have said is true. I dreamt that I was tied in a chain and I tried so hard to untie myself from that chain, but I could not. So this is the issue now. This diabetes is very... Little. But this issue of the house. Oh God. It nearly took your life. Thank so God. You have to to you have My name is Chinini Misach. I come from Busega. I'm standing here to confirm the prophecy man of God gave me when he was praying for me. And I came here with the sickness of diabetes, but he gave me a prophecy concerning the house and the chain. What he has said is true. It's true I got a dream when I was being tied up with ropes. Ever since then, I've never had peace. Even when I'm walking, I feel like I'm put on bondage. Even if I want to do something, I feel like something is wrapping my hands, tying my hands and legs. Therefore, what the man of God has said is true. The other issue concerning the house, it's true I bought a house after buying that house I got sickness from there but before getting the sickness the owner of that house who sold it to me there was a room in that house and he said that that's where he prays from and he told me that if it's possible I should also pray from that same room when I tried to go into that room when I went out of that room when I put in the key to lock the door the key broke I tried to open that door and it, I failed till I went to get some people who can help me to open that door and break it down but I got sickness from that house that's where I got the sickness of diabetes I lost all the money I lost peace Therefore, I ran out of the house. Eventually, I sold off the house. So the prophecy is very true. And I thank God, the Lord who sent prophet, prophet, I ask you to forgive me because I was already put on bondage but still I was arguing but I thank Jesus who has revealed whatever was hidden I thank Jesus for healing me and for that reason may God bless you before you got the diabetes there's a type of lotion it is liquid you use. My name is Achen Jacqueline from Wandegi. What the man of God has said is true. The, the lotion is called pork leg. And then I, I've left using it. Pitiwa Achen Jacqueline Vide Wandegi. A lotion is on Jimani A. It's a pork leg. Now you can't even go to Jukosesa. With that lotion, 
There is a time you could fail to breathe. The man of God has said is true. I felt as if my chest is blocked mm -hmm. by then. Mm -hmm. If you could enter you and you, you feel it. it. What is it? What the man of God has said is 100% correct. You don't have a wife this time. I have a wife, man of God. But you eat this junk food. Or you have You eat I'm Paul Muya from Hoima, but I'm a born of Kenya. But I do some field work, so I eat whatever okay. I go for. Man of God, what you've said is true. Mpitiwa Paul Moya, Nzaliwa, Kenya, Neka Timbera Hoima, Emili Mujenko La Jakutambule Mubialo, Katjemba Sanzi Yojengenzo Kola Chendia. In the name Jesus. Father is your son. Chitafono Mutabani Wo. Have mercy upon him. Musa Sire. Raise up. Yimuka. You dream that you are trying to cross the river. And you were weak. Say, oh God, even this just a river which is small like this, I cannot cross it. Oh God. God, what you are saying is very true. So I pray for you to cross this river. Father, give him a good time to live. Brother Joseph has diabetes. Mami Joseph, I know Brother Wasukali. At a level of 16.8. Ali tundu kumina kaga na utuntundu munana. Same time he has hepatitis B and a liver disease. Kama ino Brother Wachibumba. Brother Zap. Yimuka. There is a place where you people were buying some meat. Wali wachifobantu mweje mwagula nge nyama. And you could go there early in the morning and say, give me hot, hot one. Ila wakenda nga yu kumachano magamba. Mumpeche chocha, mumpeche chocha. Mumpeche chocha. Yoge debitofu. What you said is true, man of God. Amanyaka ngezi, sikamanya Joseph. Sikamanya Joseph are my names. Vili de boyo gerere. From boyo gerere. Nisaja wakatu anda choge de chitofu. What you said is true, man of God. Kali ngezi wuko kubucha. I went to the butcher. Nesabe nyama. And I asked for meat. Nyama ye imbizi. It was pork. Ask for hot pork. Don't do this again. Don't do this again. And take. stop eating pork. Stop it like this. Now you are free. Thank you, Jesus. The madness. Let the Margaret with hypertension. Margaret and pressure. You for 20 years. It is when they told you the land issue. And you said, ah, uh ah, -uh, And you said, no, I don't want to involve myself in the land issues. You tell me about it, but I will not involve myself. What you have said is true, man of I'm Margaret. I'm Margaret. Mm -hmm. You started getting so worried. And you said, can't a poor one have his own possession? In the name of Jesus. Have your My name is Mukuya Margaret. I come from Namayumba. When man of God was praying for me, he gave me a prophecy concerning the issue of the land. The land issues came yeah, about like this. What the man of God has said is true. Our mother produced us four children. Me, I came with my mother into that marriage. So my mother got married with me. My stepfather loved me a lot and he gave me his clan names and they are the names that I use up to today. But when my stepfather died, he left saying that that land should be given to us, the four children, that we may share it. And so my two sisters sold off their land and they said that I'm a child who came with my mother to that marriage, so I'm not supposed to own land. They wanted to take my share of the land. 
Kati muna ngono muna nwa nilira nyona agenda nekwero sina gati netimanja tetiteke duwa kutunda. Mbaba so, atunde chaa webe bama nyifebia feka bisigale waba vili. So my other sibling fought a lot for me on my behalf and even went to the LC chairman and said that my own portion of land was not supposed to be sold. If the other two sold their own portion of the land, it was their own business. Ours was meant to be left alone. Katwebata ndiko kole ebie ebie entalo nzene mba gambe ebie taka. Kambi vemo kwante omuavu tabi ilanakake. Nzembi vude mwa muna ambu ilange vigenda maso. So when they started up that conflict, I told them I've left this land issue because a poor person never owns anything. So I told them I've left the issue up to you. Katokuva mchisere cha wenatandi kilokuluala, nibatandi kukungo wakumirimu, business zenko la zezifa, kale ya msajia katonda chayo gebe chitu. From that time I started falling sick, they started chasing me from jobs, my business has collapsed, therefore what the man of God has said is true. But there is a God in heaven. Where are you katonda mugulu? I tell you today, who sent his son Christ Jesus and healed the woman of the hemorrhage? I know today, today, God in heaven, through the Holy Spirit, in the name of Jesus Christ. Will work out a miracle. Gentlemen, there is an old house. All of a sudden you went there. But still, you dream that you have gone back to that old house. Please enlighten me, man of God. It's like a family house. It is old, it's not new house. Man of God, we don't understand why you've said is true. My name is Mweske Martin from Nansana. The old house you're talking about is our house in the village, Bushenyi, where we were born. Currently, my sister built a new house there. I often go there, but I always dream when I've gone back to the village, to that old house. All the time you want to go abroad? You remember? What you've said is true, man of God. For years I've yearned to go abroad. Whenever I see you on television praying for people, I say, oh God, but what really happened to me? I don't know why I don't go abroad, man of God. So whenever you want to go abroad, you dream that you have gone back to that old house. Man of God, what you've said is true. Whenever I want to go abroad and I've made contacts and I've made the connections, I dream instead when I've gone back to the village, to that old family house you have talked about. So, so I'm, I'm here to remove you from the village and take you to city, to greater cities. worry about your husband. Where is him? Something is going on wrong. Mm -hmm. Ever since you dreamt a man sleeping with you in the dream, this relationship, marital issue, zero. It's a man of God. You're a beautiful woman. Somebody looks at you and says, hey. She is beautiful. But things of men is not in your computer. My name is Namatov Shakira. I come from Deva. What man of God I say is true. Since I dreamt of this spiritual man, I don't like men. 
a lot of men have come around me and they say they want to, to marry me they want to come and see my parents but i'm like I'm, i don't i don't i don't like the things of men even the man or the petrol station you told him please 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 just forgive me forgive me Allah. What man of God has said is true. Come, come, I remove this demon. In the name of Jesus. Raise up. But listen. You went to buy the blood. That's true, man of God. And they said, ah, I hear people buy old blouses. They pick very fine ones. I want this good one like this. That's a man of God. I went one day in the market. And they went to buy bras. Then I was like, they buy good bras and they are cheap. Let me try to buy one. Ever since you bought that one, the old black, the spiritual man came. And kick you out of the marital issues. That's true, my love God. Lady Evelyn has a back egg together with evil attacks. You dream an accident. And you dream you are too fast. And something comes and knocks you. I'm just man of God. I'm called Francis Saro. I thought I dreamt that. Uh, I was getting an accident. As a matter of fact, I also tried to fall when I was driving. And in the name of Jesus Christ. Accidents out. You went and uh, surveyed the old house. After surveying that old house, you started dreaming of this accident. Yes, man of God, where I stay, there's mm. an old house in Katagobwa. And uh, beside that old house, there are some graves. Chogede chitufu msajja wakatonda, jembe ere chitagobwa, wali ya nyumbe nkade, era kumabalige nyumbe yo, wali wa malaro. So don't worry. Tewela likirira. I'm called Francis Saro. I'm 43 years old. I come from Kitagobwa. Pitiba Mwami Francis Arob, ninemi akana mwesatu mvili de Chitagobwa. I came here when I was stressed. When the man of God was praying for me, he gave me two prophecies. One, the man of God said, I normally have a dream of an accident. Something comes and knocks me when I'm moving fast. I confirm this prophecy to be very, very true because I normally drive myself with a vehicle and I dream that I'm moving so fast and something comes and knocks me from behind. The man of God prophesied and, and said that uh, I went and surveyed an old house. Indeed, after surveying the old house, I started getting dreams of accidents. I was trying to settle, so I went with blockers and builders to an old house where I surveyed and even entered that old house. After surveying, after surveying that old house, I started getting dreams of accidents. So I dream that I'm knocking people or something is knocking me. So what the man of God is saying is true 100%. I thank Jesus for delivering me, for healing me, and giving me total uh, deliverance, salvation, and breakthrough. Thank you, Jesus. Brother Isaac has peptic ulcer's disease. Together with business failure. Touched his sister Stella. 
You dream that somebody is strangling you. Yes, man of God, After it's true. After that, you go out, you quarrel a lot. Yes, man of God. God. And you fight. No, man of God, what you're saying is true. Come here. Mm-hmm. You are mad named. Hey! Yes. Father, she's your daughter. Father, have mass upon her. You are free. I'm called Nyakato Stella from Fort Poto. Nyakato Stella Mviride Fort Poto. When the man of God was praying for me, he prophesied that I got a dream. When something was strangling me. And then ended up uh, quarreling and fighting. What the man of God said was true. I, I dreamt that I was fighting with something. I was unable to see the face. It was something uh, that was kind of masked. I told that uh, to my parents about the whole issue of that dream. After two days, everything that would come across, I would always be angry. I would always feel like fighting. Uh, actually, three days after, I fought with my younger sister. When my dad came and intervened, I ended up exchanging bitter words with him. I felt so bad that I ended up even running away from home for a week. After a week, I decided to go back and lie to them that I had got a job in Kampala. I didn't tell them where exactly I was. And up to now, they don't know where exactly I am. They know that I'm here working when I'm not. I've, I've been so restless. I don't even have peace at all. Because I'm used to my father's pampering. So that what the man of God said was true. I asked Jesus to forgive me. And my parents to forgive me too. Brother Caesar has chest pain. With the spirit of imprisonment. Rise up. Remember the shrine. Remember the shrine at the tree. The tree is thorny. There's a shrine at that thorny tree. So this is where your problem comes from. What did you go to do there? I'd gone to acquire witchcraft to get a job. Yes, sir. Now, have you seen how Satan is using you? Yes, man of God. Imprisonment. You went there how many times? I went there twice. Imprisonment, how many times? Two times. Yeah. Two times, man of God. Never go to sin again. I'll remove you from this satanic house. And this kavuma, let him not take you. Man of God, what you've said is true. I know kavuma. I know I know him as my friend. I've always been moving with him. I've always been moving with Kavuma. Sometimes we'll go together to witchcraft. What you've said is true. I'll not go back with him again. You'll get a job at the road work. That is where you get money and they buy a vehicle you had dreamt about three okay. times. Man of God, what you said is true about the vehicle. I've so dreamt it three times. No problem, so far like Jesus. So I'm going to the ladies with secondary fertility. Lady Sulaina has a career in fertility for three years. Nchala Sulaina in each Zara Gumok Malemia Kesatu.
You dream that somebody will kick in your stomach. Walo tango mtu akusamba mulubuto. Chetofu. That Ever is true. Since that time. Okuva mserecho. You got this uh, second infertility. Wafune kizala gumba chino. Yeah, chetofu. Nalo tango mtu asamba mulubuto na yeka tu omwami wange Eva Mbrembinga. Very true man of God. I dreamt when somebody was kicking me in the stomach, but now my husband is ever blaming me that I'm barren. Uh, that is not true. What you said is true. Now, go have children for him. Basatu. Produce three children for him. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Pray for ladies with poor obstetric history. Come here, come here, come here. Stop masturbating. I'm called Nachira Scovia. Mpitiwa Nachira Scovia. Mpitiwa Nachira Scovia. What the man of God said is true. Omsadja wakatonda chayoge de chitufu. Because I started this habit of masturbating while I at high school when I joined boarding section I had a friend and she told me that she would tell me let's share a bed so from that time I would hear voices telling me that we are coming today so whenever I would hear that voice I would masturbate so after that I started feeling pain in my stomach during my menstruation periods I, I get pains so when I, I went to the hospital for check up they told me I developed fibroids. So what man of God has said is true. I asked Jesus to forgive me. For private Okecho. Private Okecho Yasabirwa. He wants to be delivered a financial breakthrough. I got a sumo item. Name Jenfuna. Ever since the dream of the snake. Okuvakuro Techo Musota. It is true, man of God. You have no fair peace. So we didn't get me. Whatever you do, it does not materialize. I confirm that. My name is Anena Vivian. I'm here to confirm the prophecy of the man of God. I come from Biogerere. Ever since the dream of the snake, I've never had peace. So what man of God said is true. I dreamt of a snake. It was surrounding me. And I woke up from the dream before it surrounded me. That all came after I'd opened a construction of a house in my mother's land. And I constructed that house in a period of one month and I finished. Everyone wondered where I got money from. But ever since I had that dream, I failed to finish even the house. And I was transferred from where I was. And I've never got peace. At home, I have no peace. My finances are so, so reduced. So what man of God said is true. 100%. But I thank Jesus for bringing me here. And delivering me. It's my first time to come here. Blood of Jesus. Deliverance going on for footballer Glasso from Liberia. Somebody gave you like a stone. Mm -hmm. yes. Ever since you were given that thing, mm -hmm. you are losing your way. Yes. If you say I want to go Europe, 
or the money perish. Yes. Now three times you have tried this Europe issue. Yes. yes. So everything collapsed. Yes. Even one time you were in a hotel. Yes. And the, every money was finished, you didn't know what to do. Yes. So this town, where have you put it? I threw it away. You got it for what? One of my friends came in somewhere and said, I should take protection. And that time I was a little bit like growing up. So I look at it one day, I threw it away. I said, I won't be part of the thing again. Omu kumi kwano jange yampe ginger lino. Nangamba nteko kubela na liyo li mpobu kumi obla muwangebo na. Na hiru muna likuwa ata nendi kanyugeri. Nengamba siti agala kubela na liyo. This has troubled your love. Chino chita wanyi zobu la mubo. By the name Jesus. Neni nya yesu. Thank you Jesus. Weba le nyo yesu. Come. Jangu. So don't go to Congo. Togenda Congo. There are friends who say they will take you to Congo. Yes. Don't go. You die there. Togenda Congo. Jafira yo. You dream two countries. Katogenda kulo tama wanga abidi. Where to go? Ewa kugenda. And you choose which country? Olonde konsi ichi. Thank you. Weba le nyo. God bless you. Katonda kuwa mksa. From Mr. Wafura from Kenya. Wolgana Wafura from Kenya. Yes, come with general body weakness and pain. Azengo mbigo na mna fakitegu muluma. With evil attacks and bad dreams. Nemzi mjimulumba ina nebilo tebibi. Gimuka sebo. You people got a problem in the family. Bantumu mwafuna wizibu mufamide. There's a girl who got sick. Waliwa mwale yaluwala. True, man of God. So when this girl got sick, they collected witchcraft from this place, from the other place. This caused family to go in a different situation they don't understand. True, man of God. We are all sick every time. Ever since that girl. Where is Josephine? Josephine is my follower sister. Why you didn't bring her? I was coming she from Nairobi. She has a lot of problems. Man of God, I was coming from Nairobi. I was not able to pick her from the village. She has a lot of problems. And the back is paining her. True man of God. Though that chest problem went, but it has not gone all of it. Yes, man of God. So she has it like ulcers now. Yes, man of God. Bring her for prayer. I will, man of God. She's not a bad lady. Yes, man of God. Thank you, Jesus. Brother Juma from Kenya has come with failure in finances. Man of Jesus. He has two cases in court. I name Sangebili Mukoti. Jesus is intervening in his situation. Yes, you have a man song as a. Hands up. Yimu Kasebo. Ever since that shop issue? Yes, I will be man of the true man of God. You have not settled. You, have not settled you dream of God. that they are chasing you. Yes, yes, man of God. Though they have not caught you. Yes, man of God. It was one day when they caught your leg. Yes, the man of God. The right leg. And it is now paining. Yes, true man of God. The mighty name of Jesus. By the blood of Jesus. Be free. Father is your son. Have mercy upon me. My names are Robert Juma from Kenya. Robert Juma Kenya. When the man of God was, was praying to me, he talked about my business. I get the business yange. Which is doing very bad. My shop was full of stock. Business yangu yari jude, ebiintu. But as now the shop is empty. Na yeka tete duka kalu. Any time I get money. Buri sela wenfuna sente. There is a problem. Wabeda wabuzibu. In my family. Family yangu. So what the man of God said was true. No reche msa jackson chaga dechi tufu. Sometimes when I am asleep. Olumu bwe mbana never say. I normally have a dream. Ntero kufunye chiroto. Somebody chasing me with a knife. Omo tunga ngoba na kaso. But it does not get me. So what he said is true. When I wake up in the morning, my leg, my leg, right leg is a, is a, is paining. 
So what he said is true. So I thank Jesus for the healing. And we thank the man of God for the prayers. The one boy from Kenya has come with diabetes for two years. Together with hypertension. Six years ago, you were taken to a place to work. As if it was a joke. Yes, man of God. This is the result. So what you were eating there brought you this diabetes. Yes, man of God. Be healed in Jesus' holy name. My name is Esther from Kenya. Uh, what the man of God has said is true. I had a transfer. transfer. Whatever I was eating there, it was not good. So that is when I developed hypertension and diabetes. And it was not good for dieting. Now you are free. This relationship issue is a problem in marriage. It has troubled you. Is problem? pastor? Man of God, what you said is true. From man to man. Mobali na mibali. So this is big problem. You want and they your problem. When a man get you. So kiozi mobali. He loves you. You dream that somebody has come to fight you in the room. And you feel you don't like the man anymore. It's true, man of God. Father, we thank you. To bless your holy name. To kumi si kombo na yo papa. Raise up. Tele mama mama. Tele mama mama. And you had a problem with your stomach. Ozana problem kwa tumbu yako. And you said I don't want to be operated. Olobi olingiba opereote. Obi olingiba operingate. It's true, man of God. I don't want to be operated. I'm called Arnett, I'm from Congo. When when man of God was praying for me, he gave me the prophecy about the man. Man of God told me about the man. When I get the man who I love, I got the dream when someone comes into my room and start fighting me. What man of God is said is true. And when I get that dream, I feel like I don't love that man again. Man of God, what you said is true. Since that day, I went to Arua so that I can get witchcraft so that men can love me. I paid a lot of money, but I didn't get anything there. Man of God told me about the problem of my stomach. Man of God, what you said is true. I always feel my stomach pain and I ask myself, oh my God, I'm going to be operated again. So, man of God, what you said is true. Thank you, man of God, for praying for me. Thank you, Jesus, for healing me.
Lady Divine from Rwanda has come with cough. For 10 years. Your people get depressed. And some of them run mad. So this is the problem you have too. My name is Ingabire Jessica. This is called Devina, she's my young sister. We are from Rwanda. I'm here to confirm the prophecy that was talked about my young sister. When the man of God was praying for my sister, he prophesied about her. He said that in our family we are so depressed always. So I confirm that prophecy that it is 100% true. And he further said that because of too much depression in our family, some of our family members run mad. I also confirm that prophecy that it is 100% true. Because even last year, he's our cousin who ran mad. For that depression, I'm living as an example. Because even at my working place, in my normal ways, I'm always feeling that depression, so I'm always feeling depressed. I don't know what to do. So whatever man of God has prophesied about my young sister is really true. So, after praying for you, everything will be all right. Brother Michael was come with peptic ulcer's disease. Brother, when you were in school, you were very clever. And uh, you opted to be a lawyer or a banker. What you've said is true, my name is Mwesezi Mike. Whenever I was in class, when I would look at the blackboard, initially I would understand everything I was studying it started that whenever I look at the blackboard I would get pain in my eyes I wanted to be a lawyer but I failed so you dream a woman overwhelming you in the dream a lot of people Man of God, what you've said is true I don't spend a month and the, the person I keep dreaming is my stepmother. In the name of Jesus. Be free. Mm. Brother Suleiman has a frontal headache. For 10 years. Be free in Jesus. Brother. Ever since you went to that house where there was sugar canes. You got this problem. Ten years ago. That house was not all that big house. But here, besides, there were some sugar canes. Man of God, what you've said is true. My name is Nsiro Sulaiman from Chengera. What you've said is true. I went to that house and it's at the side of my mother's family. Mm -hmm. There was some sugar cane by the side of the house. And that is where you got the chest problem. It comes like this. It goes up to the back of the bone. What you've said is true, man of God. I have chest pain and I have dry cough. And you didn't write it here. I had many prayer requests, man of God. Don't worry. You're going, you're going abroad is clear now. Mm. 
You're going abroad is clear. You miss even going to China. Now the Lord God Those are the countries I've been thinking about most and desiring to go to because most of my friends are over there. Mr. Omara has allergic rhinitis. Because whenever you quarrel, this attack comes. Uh, my name is Omara Bernard. It is Omara Bernard. Man of God, enlighten me a bit. I say stop quarreling. Yes, sir. Whenever you quarrel, this attack comes and you feel this allergic to the eyes, it, it, the war face. No, we don't get you one to another mass of it. What day? And this is what happened to your mom. I touch your chair to come to my mom. Same sickness. Very true. Very true, man of God. When I talk about it, it's very true. My mother has the same, same, same problem. Mama, I know it's a way. Jesus. Yes, so. My mother has the same problem, man of God. Mama, I know it's a way. The same, same sickness. She sneezes like me. Same, same. I'll be me a singer. Be healed in Jesus' holy name. Thank you, Jesus. You are now free. Stop quarreling. My name is Omara Bernard. When the man of God was praying for me, he told me uh, whenever I quarrel, that's when I get the attack of the allergic rhinitis. I've had a Allergic rhinitis for the last six years. What the man of God said is true. I quarreled with my wife. Uh, the quarrel came after we had just finished praying the dowry. There, there was disagreement in their family. They didn't want me to marry her. But later on, they accepted. But ever since we came back from that marriage, we started developing a misunderstanding in our house. My wife didn't want to accept my mother to come to my house. She quarreled with my mother. It forced me to quarrel with her and I had to beat her. From that time, I developed allergic rhinitis. I failed in finances. For the last six years, nothing is working out for me. So what the man of God has said is very, very true. And uh, uh, I ask Jesus to forgive me. You dream that there is a pit. <laughs> this pit is not of water. Things which you don't understand. Like this. Oil or whatever. Uh, and say, eh, you are about to fall into the pit. It is big. And you say, oh God. What is this? I, had I fallen there, I would have died. Yeah. <laughs> <It's too. laughs> My name is Malwal from South Sudan. When man of God says it's true. Mm. So you know God loves you. And he saved you from South Sudan. Yeah. The issues I will not talk about. Yeah. Yeah. And I will not mention even this vehicle issue. Mm -hmm. so, mm -hmm. I will not mention. Father <laughs> is your son. Have mercy upon me. They are demanding you this and that. What is it going on in the family? Uh, my name is Kizito Henry. Uh, I'm a resident of Kawempe. Kawempe. But I come from Maige district. I have a lot of demands from Nine? my widow mother. Mama wange, namu andu, amanje, are you the heir? 
No, I'm not the hair. Why is it that everybody is demanding from you? As of now, they don't have someone to support them apart from me. I'm Let me pray for you. Jesus to help you. Supply you. All your needs. And the Lord my God will supply you all your needs according to his riches. In Christ Jesus. Follow Jesus. Spirit of lust will not help you. My name is Mutembuzi Rogers. My name is Mutembuzi Rogers. I come from Kamocha. Uh, when prophet was praying for me, he gave me a prophecy. spirit of lust. And he told me that I have a spirit of lust. Uh, I confirm that what man of God has said is true. Uh, because while I was in Fort Porto, I got a woman. We were still studying and I produced with her two children. But on the side, I had a girlfriend. And yet I also loved her so much. So, I asked Jesus to forgive me. I'm not going to repeat that bad habit. And I also had a spirit of lust towards other girls. I would always admire them. But I promised Jesus I'm not going to do it again. So Chen, Mami Chen, how is it? <sighs> I'm feeling a lot of power. It was Sunday morning. You watched our program on Glorious Times. And you said, but is this thing true? Yes, Pastor. <laughs> you said, you man, are you for real? Let me examine and see whether this guy is for real. But you man, they wanted to switch off. You said, no, 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 don't switch off. I want to see this man. You point at the TV. You guy, are you for real? But this, ha. Prophet, how did you come to know? I was watching you. My name is Charles Ocheng. I come from Chireka. But originally, it's from Serere. Man of God, what you are telling is true. I have a girlfriend of mine. I've not yet married her. We are watching. I was watching Glorious TV. Now for her, she wanted to change to another station. I grabbed the remote of the TV. I told her, no. There is something I'm watching here. I was supposed to come here two weeks ago. But whenever I want to come here, I get engagement. I get engagement. It is very true. Man of God. Let me watch this guy and see. It's true, man of God. Are you not fake? Man of God. You know what, I say? what about this power? But you are throwing your brothers down like this. But you guys, are you serious? Man, man of God, I said. That ah, I have been watching this man since Gloria Times TV started. But I've been doubting him because I've been hearing a lot of things. Mm. But let me first prove what this man is really doing. Because me personally, I'm troubled somewhere, a lot of things. So I told that girlfriend of mine, she's even at home, if she was on TV to be watching, I told her my deliverance I think is going to be in this man. Because what is he doing? I'm really proving this is a man of God. Musajja wakatonda nagamba anti eh mbadde nda bo musajjo ono okuva Gloria Stem Television lo yatandika naye mbadde mbusa buso lo bigambe ebinji byembadde mpulira naye kanso kenka kaso musajjo ono byakola kubanga nze ngo omuntu nine ebizi bubinji ebinta wanya kati nagamba girlfriend wange era jalieka gwaba ku TV kati andaba namugamba anti ndo wozo kusumulwa kwange kugenda kufa ku musajjo ono kubanga byakola bindi ete doka kasanti dalo no musajja wakatonda but this guy has a lot of power. Ne gayo na ina manyi manji nyo 
get it from? But is it for real? When it's I true, go man there, of God. <laughs> when I go there, yes. will I fall down? But if I fall down, man of God, I'll prove that it is for real. Man of God, I don't want to mention the name of the church. I've ever gone for deliverance. Mm. But when the man of God touched me, mm. I never fell down. Uh -huh. And I told that person, for me, I don't fall down. Uh -huh. I want to prove whether I can really fall down. I don't fall. It's, guy, it's women who can have those demons who fall, fall, but not men. Musajja wakatonda, saga na kugela linyali ya kanisa. Nagenda yo kusumuluwa, na yo musajja wakatonda bo yanku watako, sagwa wansi. Era nagambo mtu o yontinze, sisobo la kugwa wansi. Njaga loka kasobanga dala chitufu, nisobo la kugwa. Bakazi bebali nemi zimu, bebasobo la kugwa wansi. So siva sajja. Watch brethren. Abolgana mlabe. The power of God at work. Rise up. <laughs> so how did you do Man of God. This is power. Watch brethren. Rise up. Somebody pulled you from behind. Check whether there is somebody. No. Yeah? no, man of God. So you remove the microphone. Uh -huh. Yeah, you can talk. Thank you, Jesus. Rise up. How is that power? Is it for real? This is power from God. Okay, put your hands up and say, Jesus! Watch brethren, the moment the brother called upon the name Jesus. Rise up. Now, have you proved the power? Yes, man of God. Is it for real? It's for real. It's for real, yeah. man of God. How is it? It's like electricity. There is power, there is power, there is power. There is power in the name of Jesus. Rise up. Hmm? <sighs> eh, man of God. Yeah. That's it. <laughs> So your way to Europe is open. Within these two years you have gone. Even Canada you want to go, US. Rise up. You said I'm going, but that man. Let me not fall down. Me a gentleman. This man will not see me a gentleman. What is going on, gentleman? Man of God is power of God. Man of God is power of God. What is this picture for? This is for my father, who is missing for 20 years, 28 years. I have seen him. There was a garden issue. Why do you want to go to because this is a farm. This is a house. This is a farm. My name is the farm. I have called Deus Jichoi. Man of God, what you've said is true. The farm you're talking about is at home. This was land of my uncle and mother. They were fighting for it. 